Welcome to the Writing in Your Jammies podcast. I'm your host, Jeannie Hall, and I'm pursuing my dreams by helping you make your dreams a reality. I'm an author, blogger, podcaster, and life coach who hopes to inspire you to feel better, live happier, and go after your dreams with a vengeance. You can do it. Join me. Hello and welcome to the Writing in Your Jammies podcast. I'm Jeannie Hall, your host, and this is episode 18, Badass. I want to tell you something really, really important today. You are a badass. Now, I realize that may be hard for you to believe. I know it was for me. I grew up in a little tiny town of 1,200 people in Arkansas, USA. I wasn't really poor, per se, like living in the dirt poor, but we certainly didn't have much money. And due to the small nature of our community and the distance between us and any metropolitan areas, opportunities were pretty limited. Or at least, that's what I thought. We didn't have a target, for example. My point in revealing this to you is that I used to believe that because of that small town upbringing, I'd never be anyone important. I would never do anything important. And when I was young, I was okay with that. I was a little shy. I was a bit of a doormat. So I just figured I would get married one day, be a teacher for a little while, then leave teaching to be a stay-at-home mom. Other than falling in love and being happy, I didn't have big dreams back then. Not really. Rich and famous people seemed so far removed from me that I couldn't even imagine what their lives must be like. Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous, a show hosted by Robin Leach that I used to watch when I was a kid, might as well have been about extraterrestrials. It all seemed too impossible for me to really believe it existed. I've since learned, however, that anything is possible for me and everyone else. Not that I particularly want to be famous, though not having to ever worry about money again has a real nice ring to it. The thing is, I used to limit myself all the time. Many of us do it. We simply believe what our society and our families teach us, often with the best of intentions, to be true. We're taught that some are meant for greatness, but that those folks are few and far between, or maybe they're just lucky. That, dear listeners, is a lie. All of us are already great. We are spiritual beings choosing to have a human experience. Therefore, no matter who we are, we are capable of amazing things. The secret to tapping into this greatness is becoming a badass, or more accurately, believing you are one. And you are one. You really are. You are made of light. You are made of love. You are so powerful that you freaking create your own life with your thoughts and feelings. For real. I mean, my God, how crazy wonderful is that? We are not victims. Not unless we choose to be. So I'm asking you to choose. I'm asking you to choose to be a badass. When we become badasses, we become the incredible beings we were always meant to be. We are capable of so much love and joy. We are capable of healing ourselves. Our bodies automatically do that already. We are capable of making our world better simply by being aware of our true place within it. 
When we use that massive amount of love we all carry to love ourselves, we are rocked to our very foundations. Being petty or angry at traffic or frustrated by something a family member did all become so unnecessary. When you live as the beautiful divine creature that you really are, suddenly it's easy. It's easy to love yourself. It's easy to love your loved ones even more. It's easy to love everyone more. Being a badass means you don't apologize for doing the best thing possible for yourself at all times, for taking care of yourself physically, mentally, spiritually, and in every other way possible. And the cool thing is, it makes it so much easier to give to others. Loving yourself, ironically, is the most unselfish action you could ever take. So be a badass. Make living awesome. Make all your decisions awesome badass decisions. Love like a badass. Give like a badass. Don't be afraid. Be a light onto the world like a badass. Go after your dreams like a badass. Because the more of a badass you are, the happier you'll be. The more inspired you'll be. The more beautiful you'll be. Badasses don't limit themselves or choose to live small when they're meant to live big. Badasses love and live unapologetically. They are completely 100% themselves at all times. So go out into this vast world of ours with the confidence of a badass. This world was created for badasses after all, and you are one. So be that badass and go get it. Thanks so much for listening to this podcast. Go to writinginyourjammies.com to sign up for my brand new Rejuvenation for Writers six-week comprehensive program to help writers reignite their creative sparks. You're just a free mini session away from becoming the amazing author you've always wanted to become. You really can be whoever you want to be. Thanks again.